Huh. Right, my friend is fixing a, a slew motor on a little digger. The pinion and shaft are stripped out and he couldn't find one anywhere so he asked me if I knew of anyone who would have one. Um, I asked Friday Parts and they had it in stock so they sent it to me. So we're going to install that today and uh, see if we can get the machine back up and running. They even sent a new bearing. Nice. That looks pretty good to me. Nice. So it's quite a small shaft to what it does, isn't it? It is. How heavy is the, the machine? Well, it's only a wee Kubota UH17. Oh yeah, 1.7. So, yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Now, do you know what caused it or is it just one of those? I don't things? know what causes that. It could yeah. well be operator just banging things with yeah. it on the slew and yeah. Okay. Quick stops and yeah. Yeah, I was always told never to use the, the slew to push things. But yeah. Like everyone does it, don't they? They do, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, just a wee bit up in there. That looks like a well machine piece of bloody equipment there. I'm quite impressed with that. Yeah, that's good. So there's not a lot of pressure in there against it. Oh, there's only case drain. Yeah. Oh yeah. Cool. I have no idea how much that, that would be worth, but <laughs> probably not cheap, eh? Well, I'll tell you what, I wouldn't know how much it was because I needed a new pump. I can only get a new... I can't buy that. Oh, right. Is that right? Well, the normal sources. Wow. And that whole unit seven and a half grand where I got paid. Is that right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, he'll be happy then. Yeah. <laughs> Bingo. I'll have to put it on there. Oh, uh, yeah. That on there. Yeah. So you're not putting all the stress on the balls. Yeah. Right in the center there. I think we've got enough room. Go home. Push. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I hope it stops soon. <laughs> you just put some lock light on there? Or? No, I just put some gas gasket maker on it. Some marks on there to remember which way it goes.
So the bearings looped by the hydraulic oil? Or? Yeah. Oh, okay. yeah. Except the bottom one, it's um, sealed. Yeah. Yeah. So the grease is just to hold it all together when you put it on? Yeah. Uh, Yeah, you've got to hold that in there while I tip yeah. that up. It's going to be the awkward bloody thing. Yeah. Right, oh, let's hope this works. That's good. I think we got it. Pulse. Jiggle, does it? It's it's spring loaded, you see? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yep. Oh, yep. Closing up. No parts left over? <laughs> no, it doesn't appear to be. Yeah. It's all down, I think, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's closed up. Will it spin? Well, probably won't be able to. No. Um, okay. be too tight. Yeah. Yep. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ready to go back on then? Ready to go back on. Nice. What we'll do is we'll give this a bit of run and see what it's going to do. Make sure it's going to do its thing. So they wanted seven grand for this uh, whole complete the whole unit. unit yeah. Unit. Well, it would probably be eight grand by the time you got the bloody thing a year and Yeah.
So it goes that way, not that way. You can guess without guarantee that Murphy's going to tell me that I've got it wrong. Job done. Thanks to Friday Parts, we saved the excavator owner about seven or eight thousand dollars because we couldn't find those parts anywhere else, and we would have had to buy the whole uh, drive motor if we couldn't get them. So thanks, Friday Parts, much appreciated. I'll leave a link to their website in the video description below. They've got a, a promotion on at the moment, so yeah, go go check them out if you're looking for machinery parts. I thought it was quite interesting seeing how the swing motor is put together. I've never actually seen one done before, so quite interesting to see Brownie do that. I learned a few things along the way. The Eaton motor is standard. Yeah. The agents put their own pinion, or whoever built the machine, Kubota, make their own pinion and stuff to suit the Eaton motor. Ah. So you can't get it through Eaton, that right. pinion and house it. Oh, okay. Mm. They've probably done that deliberately, have they? Well, it would mm. be, yeah. They've, gone and got a commercial motor and that he's so old and adapt it to fit a yeah. make air machine. Mm. That would be my pick anyway, but I could be wrong. Yeah. That'll be eighty years old? Uh, they were built for the war. Yeah, so 1940s. There's yeah. a mouse. There's a mouse there <laughs> as well. Come out for the camera. Corps of Engineers, U.S. Army, Airborne oh, Equipment, Tractor Crawler, Grass Gasoline. That's a major rebuild. She might be a bit of strip out from the start, I think. Yeah, because if that's been off that pipe, yeah. there's some water going straight in there, wasn't it? And that. It's all like... fixable, though. Yeah, is it? Hmm. Oh, yeah. And they build airfields out of them with the islands and yeah. up behind up and they, had, they shipped them in in D day ahead of the bloody, you know, up the front. You know. Oh yeah. These are the ones that made the fir first holes in the jungle for the first planes to land and then then they shipped them D sevens and all the oh, rest yeah. of them. Mm. Where did this one come from, you know? Well it came from America, but a guy bought it from a guy out. Uh, north of Auckland, who imported it from America, but uh, his research tell me a bit of a military buff. His research tell it's the only one in the southern hemisphere. But I don't know. I've seen several in America in museums. Yeah. And there's one in the in the in the museum in the Airborne Museum in Saint Mary on days in France when I went to the D-Day thing. Oh yeah. There's a there's a glider and a DC-3 and one of these and they carry them in the DC-3s or the glider, oh, yeah. mostly gliders, but they're pretty lethal. When they had a jeep or one of these and the glider and the glider crashed, which they frequently did, these things took the pilot head off. <laughs> well, they didn't, they couldn't win. When they hit the bottom, they even yeah. pretty well lashed down, didn't they? Well, you, you'd, you'd sort of video trying to get this one going, that one going or something. Yeah, if you don't mind. Oh, I don't mind. Yeah. <laughs>